Why, hello everyone! Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Remake on Playframe. We're inside the Shinra HQ at last. We're kind of in the home stretch, I think, of this remake. Although it might be a very long home stretch, given <laughs> given how long most of the other stretches of this game have been. That's fine, though. I'm looking forward to somehow getting in there. Don't know how yet. Let's uh, keep going up, I guess. Although, uh, there might be some goodies around here if we actually look. Yeah, see? This is why we look. Gotta find a place to get rid of Moogle Metals. <laughs> There's gotta be some place. Has to be. That's a cool display, though. All right, all right. Y'all have been patient. Let's go. So, how do we get upstairs? Either the elevator or the emergency stairwell. Yes. Isn't the lab we're looking for on one of the top floors? I vote we take the elevator. That's a good idea. We'll try that first, Barrett. But I kind of get a feeling that that's not going to woo. Lovely. What a nice bike. Um, authorized key card required. That makes sense. I'm digging this lobby. This looks gorgeous. Got a cafeteria. It's all pretty and nice and a little foreboding all at once. <laughs> Just some exquisite environment design, as always. Uh, okay. Need a key card there, too. Not great. No getting upstairs without a key card, huh? I think we're gonna need a few before this is over. Pretty sure I saw one lying around. Huh. Gotta get in there. The reception desk. Yeah, but... How to get in. Ooh, from above. 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 Go up and over, maybe? Look. Pretty sure we could reach it if we hop across those lights. Heck yeah. I don't know. Or we could just give, like, Tifa a lift, but this is good, too. I think I'll give it a shot. As the lightest one here, I figure I've got the best chance. You two can sit back and watch. No. <sighs> We get to control Tifa. Yes, finally. Haha. -ha. I was hoping. Uh. And that. Wow. It's amazing, actually, that this run looks very like her run in the original game. It evokes it. it. Like, it looks better than that original run, but it, like, the stride feels right. That's really impressive. That's really impressive. The animator has just absolutely killed it. Man. This has been so fun. Okay, guys. Wish me luck. You be careful. Aren't I always? <sighs> careful. And jump. Okay. I'm already so excited for the rest of this remake to come out. No matter how long it takes. And we're definitely, like, we're definitely doing that on this channel. No, no. <laughs> Glad that couch was there. I thought I was dead for sure. Well, now we can wander around down here. This is fun. Hmm. Got some cars. What else is around here? Ooh. Trains. This is really cool. What is this? Just a really cool show floor. Ooh, and goodies. Oh, 
Wait, what's down here? I should probably check. Oh, just circles around. That's fine. Okay, so, um... Climbing up on this, huh? <laughs> or this one. And then... No? Hmm. Hang on. We're gonna climb on one of these. And that's gonna give us... Here we go. Yes. Here we go. Perfect. Hands sort of. Hands, huh? That's fine. Bring <laughs> it on. Uh, she's great. Come on. Oh, we gotta go sideways. Here we go. Come on. There we go. And... Boy, we're just having to parkour all over this dang thing. I am so glad they gave us a chance to uh, control Tifa for just a little bit. Let's see... And then, uh, one more. This isn't so bad. Pretty close now. Just need to make it over there. Yes. And then I see a. Oop. Nope. Nope. We did something wrong. <laughs> Here we go. Yes. Uh, almost. There we go. Good. And then what? What now? Over here? Maybe? Yes, here we go. We got this. It definitely would have been easier <laughs> for Cloud and Barrett to give Tifa a boost. Almost there. Just need to get across those platforms. We could definitely have given her a boost to just get on top of that thing, but this is also fine. <laughs> it lets us control Tifa for a bit. I'll allow it. By the way, they, it turns out they are releasing a soundtrack for this, finally. Or maybe they already will have by the time this episode comes out. It's like a big, giant seven-disc thing. For just part one <laughs> of this remake. I'm so happy. Okay, there you go. Alright, swing. Wait, so do I keep pressing forward, or... Hang on. Okay. Oh, okay, I get it. All right, so I'm pressing triangle at the right time to uh, swing better. Gotcha. There we go. Yeah. Almost. Here we go. Good. And we're in. <laughs> That's some fine work. So now you're I stuck here. Able to disable security from here. Huh? <laughs> Hot damn, girl. But I didn't do anything. Shit, I'll take it. So you can use that to look up what floor the research facility's on. I think so. Give me a sec. <sighs> hey, this is my job. Bingo. Professor Hojo's lab. 65th floor looks like cloud presses buttons huh guess we can only get to the 59th floor via the elevators or stairs to access any level above that we need to check in at the skyview hall reception 59th floor it is then mm -hmm. right all right up we go so our options are elevator or stairs yes so this looks like elevators. And I think that they are... Hmm. Let me check. I'm very curious. Uh, nope. Not this. Uh, okay. Take the elevator to the 59th floor, or climb the emergency stairwell to the 59th floor. I think they're gonna let us do either. And the original game let us do either as well. I am definitely 
definitely taking the stairs. Because <laughs> it was one of my favorite things from the game originally, and I bet it's going to be fun. I'm very excited. This is the stairwell, yes? Yeah, it is. Well, let's poke around just to make sure there's no items or whatever. Cloud, could you move a little faster, please, bud? Buddy. Pick up the pace just a bit. Fine. You have got to be shitting me. <laughs> nope. We're a lot less likely to get caught this way. But a lot more likely to die of boredom. Nah, Barrett, we're doing it. <laughs> it's only 59 floors. Nothing to it. Well, at least it ain't a race. Small blessing. All right, squad, let's do it. And one. <laughs> Wonder what it's like up there. More security and restrictions. It's not going to get any easier. We're going to be exhausted by the time we finally get to the top. As long as you pace yourself, you'll be fine. Sorry for the spinning Maybe camera. we should take a quick break. Come on, Barrett. <laughs> I'll try to kind of slow it down a little bit at each landing so the camera doesn't spend too much on y'all. You can stop if you want. You can even say it's for me. Just say you can't hack it. I'll hack you, jackass! Oh, that's enough from both of you. Stupid arguments aren't gonna get us there faster. But Tifa, I wasn't... <laughs> Not now. Save it for the top. And this is why we did this. Because the dialogue's great. And Cloud's getting tired. He's not running anymore. <laughs> I can't go faster than that. <laughs> uh, we're going to be going at a snail's pace by the end, aren't we? Work those legs. Only 70-something floors to go. No, no, I was wrong. Bad math. 30 or 40, whatever. Guess these labs and shit are all the way at the very top. Yep, the very top. That's good to know. <laughs> I love this. Keep an eye out there. Copy. What was that? I don't think I heard you. Speak up. I'll keep an eye on Barrett. <laughs> oh, thanks for. The assist. Tiva, slow down. You're too in shape. Whatever. Barrett, you alright? 23. <laughs> We're almost halfway. <laughs> Barrett, how are you holding up? Feeling good? Now, Barrett, I'm here for you if you need a hand. I can carry you. We can go piggyback. Hey, Where are you? <laughs> hey. just a few floors behind you. <laughs> hey, thirty, oh? halfway. You're sounding better. Think I've got like a stair climber's <laughs> I'm so glad they let you do this again. It was a real funny option in the original. So I had a feeling they would do it, but, uh... <laughs> oh, we're slowing down. Hey! I was, but I'm feeling okay. What are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's roll! <laughs> That's the spirit. You really are doing better. 
We we gotta keep moving. <laughs> to keep moving. Woo! <laughs> Hard to argue with that. Let's go. This voice cast has been rocking it, by the way. Like, kudos especially to Barrett's voice actor. Like, Barrett, as he's written, doesn't tend to have a lot of nuance, but, like, there's some real nice nuance to the way that the uh, actor's performing him in places, and, uh... Yeah, he's been great. They really all have. I'm amazed at how well cast this is. Cloud, you can't do better than walk <laughs> now. But tell me, these stairs... Are these stairs ever gonna end? I don't know. Ask the stairs. Tifa, I can barely even hear you. Well, duh. I mean, duh. I was joking. That's enough from both of you. <laughs> this is a good video game. Cloud, pick up the pace, though, bud. We're getting close. Worst route ever. Give me a suicidal last day. At least, at least, at least that didn't happen here. Let's shut up. Yes, let's. No, no. <laughs> Keep talking. Wow. Almost there, everybody. Because wishing for trouble might bring it. Yep. And you're in no state to fight anyway. So, what should I do? Shut up and move. <laughs> He's moving so slow now. Uh, hang in there, Cloud. Don't topple over and die. He's got nothing left. <laughs> Five left. You can make it, Barrett. I believe. <laughs> you look so tired. This sucks! I want to go back! You want to go down all those stairs you just climbed? <sighs> we can make it. Three to go. We're gonna make it. Another day, another struggle. Climbing stairs, so much trouble. Almost. One more. One to go. <laughs> Cloud, slow down. You're going to make it, Barrett. Cloud, slow down. I did. I'm at the top. <sighs> Go, team. We are not in fighting shape. Challenge starts now. Okay, let's go. <laughs> uh, good times. 70, 80, 90, 100%, 110. 
Mako, super saturation confirmed. <laughs> Engaging materia cooling to reduce temperature. <sighs> Madame Director, you have a meeting shortly. Stop. Your timing is impeccably atrocious. <laughs> Mako density and materia integrity are both holding steady. Registering mass increase in core materia. Registered. We're leaving. Materia growth accelerating, outpacing models. Registering crystallization within the reserve tanks. The reaction is out of control. We have to stop it quickly. Clean up the mess, would you? Ma'am. So this is the Skyview Hall, huh? Bet this place cost a fortune and then some. Let's look for reception. Let's do that. I'm sure they'll be so happy to receive us. Ooh, I want to see a view. Yeah! <laughs> and some nice smooth jazz. Hey, check it out. Come oh. take a look, Cloud. I was. Y'all missed it. Pretty and marvelous and beautiful. But every little light burning bright runs off her blood. And bit by bit they bleed her, never stopping to think how it'll end for them. <sighs> yeah. Terrible but beautiful all the same. All right, squad. Search the area for chests and goodies, just in case. And act inconspicuous. To the best of your ability, I mean. I know we kind of stand out. Let's see here. The lighting in here is pretty ominous. Like, maybe it's not this dimly lit during the day, but... Oh. Hi. You must be here for our grand tour. Visitors have access to floor 60, 61, 62, as well as floor 63. You will proceed in that order. By the exit of each floor, you will find a device that will allow you to update the key card in your possession, thereby allowing you to access the next floor. And now begins your grand tour. Please enjoy the Shinra experience. Oh, you know I will. Why is this whole thing gotta be such a big pain in the ass? I don't know about you, but this is kind of weird. You think everything's going too well? Yeah, I do. Think this is a trap? <laughs> If it is, then bring it on. Let's get this party started. Sounds like a plan. Let's find a way up. Can I go this way? Am I allowed? Oop, pardon me. Here we go. Man, all we gotta get all these damn key cards just to get anywhere. This is Shinra HQ. The how did you expect? Says the former company man himself. 
Guess you know about all the rules, regulations, and red tape. It's like coming home, huh? Man, these environments, though. Uh, alright. I wonder, can we, like, approach people? Is there anything we can do to fix this? Oh, is the elevator broken? Their strength. You'll see. Ah, not authorized. Fair enough. Uh, what if I just walk up? That seems easier. And I guess we stand out slightly less if this is a bunch of floors that visitors come to all the time. But only slightly. We are a somewhat conspicuous bunch. Yes, every reactor, every pillar. Like I said, a full inspection. There's no telling what kind of damage there might be. If you see anything, anything out of the ordinary, I want to know. Sorry to bother you, sir. No, it's fine. I've brought the damage assessment for Sector 7 you requested. Sir, perhaps you should try and get some sleep. No, not yet. I need to finish preparing my draft of the reconstruction plan before tonight's board meeting. <sighs> Whatever reasons they might have had, destroying an entire sector is... It's beyond the pale. Director, I would strongly advise you not to say such things outside of this room. <sighs> Don't I know it. Who's this clown? Ah, the Memorial Museum, is it? Memorializing what? Hmm. Let's check over here just in case there's anything interesting. Probably not, though. Nah. Alright. I'm eager to see. Let me in. Welcome to the Shinra building, our humble home. Oh, hell no! Here in the Memorial Museum, you can learn all about our president, as well as the various divisions that make up the company. And, of course, the city of Midgar, and the miracle of Mako Energy. Whatever takes your fancy, you're sure to learn something new. Yeah, yeah, shut up! Well, let's go learning. And play the tourist. Uh... Let's see. Weapons, vehicles... Yeah. It's about right. Where do we start? I guess favorite cigars? What am I looking at here? I think I just threw up a little. Man thinks very highly of himself. Hmm. Who's that figure? This is interesting. I very much like this added detail. And it does feel extremely <laughs> like what this sort of character would do. And what this sort of company would do. I kind of wish that there could be, like, little audio bits I could listen to at all of these. 
But they get the idea across pretty clearly. Uh, what's in here? Hey, everybody! How's the grand tour? Yeah. I hope you're all enjoying yourselves. Wasn't it fun to learn about Shinra and our esteemed president? And to get a peek at the president's mementos? That was super cool! Interesting. So we're seeing all of their, uh... So we're seeing all of their branches and executives. I do wish that there was some voice over here, like, uh... Giving us some more info. Now, moving along. The next exhibit will teach you about the important work we do here. By giving you a closer look at each of our divisions. Okay, so I guess we're gonna get some of that info anyway. Because you simply won't believe all the exciting adventures we have here. This is super cool. I'm really enjoying this, actually. Uh, wasn't anything else I should have done out here, right? No. Okay. Let's see what awaits. These all look so familiar. Because we've destroyed a bunch of them already. All right. So advanced weaponry. Like some of these things, yeah. The advanced weaponry exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. All right, so Scarlet runs the advanced weaponry division. Then there's space and aeronautics. What? What? Uh, read this. This paper right here. Uh, give me a moment. Welcome. To the Shinra building. The Space and Aeronautics Division has taken rocket systems developed for military applications and adapted them to a different purpose. The search for new precious resources in the infinite reaches of space. That being said, since we have plenty of Mako at the present, those plans are currently on hold. It's a bit of a shame, really. Oh, same thing. Okay. Right, 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 right. Yep. Okay. Okay, so Scarlet runs Advanced Weaponry, which is their first division. Second division is uh, Space and Aeronautics run by Palmer. Third, Research and Development. Uh, welcome to Shinra Headquarters. My duties as Director of Research and Development are, in all likelihood, far beyond your ability to comprehend. So there will be no presentation, as it will be a waste of my time and yours. But rest assured, we are making great strides. Albeit not at this particular moment, because I'm filming this rubbish instead. I believe I've wasted enough of my precious time as it is. Science waits for no one, after all. So, good day. Alright, so. R&D run by Hojo. Ooh, soldier gear. Neat. Uh, let's see. Where's number four? Uh, ha, here we go. Public security. Ah, yes. With Heidegger. The public security exhibit is currently undergoing maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience. This is all of their forces. And... Oh yeah, <laughs> the hand thing. And finally, number five, urban planning. Welcome to the Shinra building. Our mission here at urban planning is to supply the residents of Midgar with energy created from Mako. We also take pride in maintaining public infrastructure, the pillars and railways that run all throughout the city. Currently, we are working to construct an intraplate expressway. When this project has been completed, 
It will provide much easier access to numerous locations all across Midgard. We appreciate your patience and understanding in the meantime. This is interesting right here. Because, like, this could be several things, each of which is interesting in a different way. Uh, option one is, it is a, like, bit of concept art for what they're thinking they could eventually turn Midgar into. Which, uh, like, so it's like a, a an eventual future plan. Option two is this is the, like, what they would plan to build as, like, a new city when they find whatever location they'd want to build that new city at. Uh, three, and this one's also very good, this was an original concept of what Midgar the city would look like, and the reality is what we have. <laughs> All of those possibilities are very good. This is great. Uh, oh, what's this a schematic for? Oh, Sector 8. Neat. So much art going into creating, like, on top of the original game, obviously, just this remake. Just so much additional work. It's really amazing. How many extremely talented people had to work together to make this thing. Impressive, wasn't it? I hope you enjoyed learning about our divisions. And the wonderful ideas and solutions that are produced to benefit us all. Here at Shinra, we strive to ensure the safety of all residents around the clock. Uh-huh. That is really interesting that they use... Mako as a, like, a, a visualization of their presence everywhere. Which it is, but like... Now, Man, that's on. slick. The next exhibit will teach you all about the miracle of Mako energy and our reactors. As well as the city of Midgar itself. So come on! This is super cool. I'm loving this segment. There's some good world building right here. This is Midgar, our home. Recreated in one ten thousandth scale. As you can see here, the eight Mako reactors form a ring around the center of our city and keep Midgar running day and night. The Mako which flows beneath our feet is a truly limitless resource. At Shinra, we have developed technologies to extract it and transform it into the fuel and electricity that powers everything we do. Thanks to the miracle of Mako energy, our lives are richer and better than ever before. Mako keeps our lights on at night, and made Midgar into the city that never sleeps. The triumph of technology and testament to man's potential. Nothing but a bunch of lies! Except that Mako has made people's lives better. It's made people blind. Blind to the cold hard truth. Even I used to buy into their bullshit. Remembering that makes me even madder. This is also good. All right, what's next then? Congratulations! You can call yourself a proud Shinra scholar. Hooray! Now, moving along. Next, you'll learn about our progress in advanced science and technology. Please proceed to the 61st floor, the Visual Entertainment Hall. You got it. Welcome to the Visual Entertainment Hall, where we showcase Shinra's cutting-edge technology. Through an immersive visual and audio experience, please relax and enjoy the show. Cosmos Theater. Interesting. Okay. All right. I'm intrigued.
This place is empty. What the hell? Somehow they learned of the great reservoir of energy pulsing beneath their feet. And once they had, the ancients developed the means to harness this bountiful energy and bend it to their will. The fruits of their labors have survived to this very day in the form of certain kinds of materia. Their scripture, too, has endured. We who are born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Alas, the ancients themselves are long gone. 2,000 years ago, a meteor brought an end to their civilization. <laughs> but before their fiery end, did the ancients find their promised land? Even now, we have only to wonder. Times have changed, and the Shinra Electric Power Company is committed <laughs> to changing and evolving with them. Like the ancients, we've harnessed the power of Mako. <laughs> Are they out there watching us, waiting for us to join them in some blessed corner of the world? A green and verdant land where boundless Mako energy will provide for our every need. Shinra is working for you to fulfill the hope of the ancients and lead us to that promised land. We shall not rest until our dream is realized. Oh dear, a man of my refined taste running out of butter. <laughs> Shorn of its proper accompaniment, this tea might as well be boiled pond water. <laughs> have been crazy ass thing made me want to puke and not just because of the presentation but the content too ought to come with a warning that ain't for kids that wasn't just a movie that huge meteor what was that about like i said nothing you should show a kid wait so the all right so hang on to digest that was a lot one the uh the initial presentation, like, I love that edition. That's so good. Not, like, not only in terms of 
some exposition and world building stuff that they otherwise would have put at other places in this game and the following ones, but also that it's laced with Shinra propaganda throughout. Like it's just so well executed on. I love that. Real curious about that thing that, uh, I love that Barrett's kind of like scratching his foot there. That's really good. Real curious about that weird ending part though, being apparently part of this hologram thing that everyone saw. I figured that was just Cloud having an episode. I don't know why everybody saw that in this dome, but then I guess I don't know how the dome works, so who knows. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the, like, the additions they're doing here are... Uh, it's not entirely new stuff. They had lots of exhibits about like Shinra's history and technology inside the original game, but it was very, very, very limited. Uh, not nearly as fleshed out as what this is, and I'm loving all this. It does seem like they're shifting some order of events around a little bit, though, if I'm... Uh, Hooray! Your mission is to go out and tell everyone about the wonders of Shinra. Pass. Next, you'll be visiting the repository for Shinra's expertise and know-how. Please make your way to the 62nd floor, the corporate archive. What the? Hello. Uh, uh. Greetings and welcome. Avalanche, I presume. My name is Hart, and it's a pleasure to meet you. I've come to escort you to Mayor Domino, per his request. The mayor of Midgar? The empty suit that's just a mouthpiece for Shinra? Yes. The mayor of our dear Midgar. The most magnificent city ever built. That Mayor Domino. The Visual Entertainment Hall has been experiencing technical difficulties of late, and he suspected that these difficulties might impede your progress. So what does the mayor want with us? I'm afraid you'll have to ask him that yourself. Guess we're supposed to follow. So what? You telling me the mayor's some kind of crazy bookworm? Through here. If this is a trap, you're a dead man, you hear? Well, let's check it out. The mayor is waiting. Kind of tempted to wander around, but I probably shouldn't. Uh, and I don't... No, wait. <laughs> there is something. The opposite dang end. The mayor is waiting. The wait... But the, the item is over here, though. Oh, fine. I'll go get it later. Mayor. Make it quick. There's a chest. This can't be right. Ah, wonderful. You finally made it. I am the mayor of the great metropolis of Mako. Domino, at your service. 
<laughs> I must say you three haven't exactly been discreet. Yeah, it's not our strength. I wonder who's been cleaning up all your messes. What the hell's going on? Come on, think about it. You've been caught by security several times, walked in front of every other camera, and scared an accountant half to death. You hear the alarm? No? You're welcome. <sighs> hmm. I can only assume your cell wasn't looped in. I am Avalanche's man on the inside. Say what? Huh. Is it really that surprising to you? You've seen where they put me. The mayor of the greatest city in the whole wide world, tucked away in a secret broom closet in the damned archives. The nerve. Those stupid Shinra pricks thought I'd just shut up and accept their treatment. But they were wrong. Dead wrong. Huh. Well, this ought to make things easier. We need to break into Professor Hojo's lab. What? Why? You mean you're not here to give President Shinra his comeuppance? We're here to save a friend who was taken. But the President's gonna get his, too, if I have anything to say about it. Mm. Well, I don't particularly care what you end up doing. So long as it hurts Shinra. Great! So, I can get you as far as the 64th floor. Hold up! You telling me that that's the best you can do? That is indeed the best that I can do. But you're the mayor. But you're the mayor? Does this look like the office of a mayor? I'm a glorified librarian, nothing more. They don't even invite me to their meetings. Sorting records and reports, that's all I do. My hands and fingers have more paper cuts than skin. No one knows my pain, my daily torment. They've made me a pathetic shell of a man. Uh, uh, okay, they did you wrong like us, but we'll make it right. So just calm down. Deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. Hmm. Let me see that key card of yours. Here you are. You can now use it to access the recreational facility on the 63rd floor. And then what are we supposed to do? You look for a fellow Avalanche collaborator. Identify yourselves and he'll give you a key card to the 64th. The countersign is... The mayor is the best! Midgar's mayor is nothing less! <laughs> Everyone says he's cooler than the rest! <laughs> Just say, Mayor, to the guy, and if he goes, the best, with gusto, then you found your man. You got it? Love it. <laughs> ah, this game is so ridiculously good, I'm enjoying it a lot. If you think you've found the collaborator, say, Mayor, and see if he says, the best. <laughs> you got it now? I do got it. By the way, the Mayor's name was a joke in the original i don't know if it was in the original uh like japanese i'm assuming no i'm assuming that this was a uh addition by the original localizer but um mayor domino uh presides over a pizza of a town anyway let's go get that dang chest i still can't believe the mayor is working with avalanche would have been nice to know idiot at hq should have kept us in the loop There we are. Lovely. <sighs> you know, I, as much as I want to keep on going, I gotta call it an episode sometime. Thank you all so very much for watching. I will see you on Monday when we continue this. I'm so, so eager <laughs> to see what happens next. Take care, y'all, and goodbye.